Hey, what's up, what's up, what's up? How you doing? It's me, Raven. What's going on? What's good? How you been? Are you getting in? Somebody's getting in for you. What's going on, people? How you doing? What's up? Okay, I want to talk to you in reference to... Hmm. I want to talk to you in reference to fashion shows. Have you ever noticed that you watch fashion shows and stuff like that on TV? That there's not that many black people. I mean, I watch a white girl, a white girl, or Caucasian, Caucasian, come out, but I never see a black girl. You know, it takes a long period of time, but then I notice that they're not really up there. So I'm trying to wonder, why is it that we're, our money is good enough to pay for your purchases, but they're not good enough to be in your show? You know, and the thing about it is that I've noticed is that we love fashion. Well, I do. Many of us, some people don't, some people do. I do. So why is it that I have to wait so long to see someone like me, of color, walk down the aisle? You know, it amazes me. It's not an equal to, it's not an equal. You know, you go like 10, 11, 12, oh, there's a black girl. And it's funny. It don't seem like it's getting any better. Why is that? All these years now. Hmm. Why is it designers get out there and stuff like that? And they forget about the ones who really purchasing their stuff. I'm not saying anyone should be a slave to fashion, but I'm just saying, you know, why is it that we do that? Also, what I've noticed is that, why is it that when it's always, it always seems like when it comes to white people, they complain to get things to happen. And when it comes to black people, we don't complain too much. We just let things happen. But then again, we have some people out there that cater to trying to, I guess, fit in. Let me give you an example. You have a job, and you're black, and you're working for corporate America, and you're white. You see a black person come through the door, you won't help them. You see a white person come through the door, you help them, because it makes you look good. I'm just saying, I've seen it happen, it is what it is. I'm just keeping it real. If you don't like what I have to say, so be it. I'm going to say it anyway. Oh, well. I've watched it happen. Anyway, I guess it goes all the way across the board. Anyway, same thing I still like basketball-wise. Basketball-wise, mm, I don't agree with a lot of stuff I see. But I have to admit, it's not much I haven't seen before. But I understand they want to do a protest and it gets basketball-wise. Hmm. Why? Because they're black. And it's an easy thing. I find it very funny when Jerry Springer's been doing it for years. Where was your protesting then? You honored it. You loved it. You watched them beat the hell out of each other. You didn't care. But now, it's gone too far. There's black people doing it. It's wrong now. It was the wrong name when it's the wrong noun. You have Mob Wives, Bad Girls Club. You're not protesting it. You understand where I'm going with this? <laughs> I feel like this. If you want to boycott basketball, watch your mom's boycott them all. If it's good for one, it's good for the goose, it's good for the candle. Don't stop there. You know, then we can keep going boycotting every damn thing. You know, the thing about it is. Why is it that it's the black show that you want to attack? Not saying I'm racist or anything, because I'm not. But you can look at me and say whatever you want to say. I know what I see, and you know what you say. So let's be real about it. I want to hear what you have to say about it. So let me know how you feel about that. I know what's wrong, it's wrong. But if we're going to do it right, let's equally kick them all out. But then what kind of point would you be setting in either? The world is not going to go exactly the way you want. I'm a living example. Because no matter what I do to myself, I'll never be good enough. You'll always find something. So my thing is, it is what it is. Anyway. It's that type of morning because I'm in food for thought. Anyway, I want to hear what you have to say about that. Why is it that it's always okay for everybody to join into the party? When it's always shooting down another black spot, but you didn't join in when it came down to 
shooting down the white spot. And why you let the white one get away with it for so long? And it is not a racial divided thing, but it is a realistic. And that's how I feel. But you can tell me how you feel. You can tell me that basketball West is so violent, and it's wrong, and it's bullying. But you know you've seen it before in other stations. So why is it, not a, big, why is it a big issue now? Because you'd rather take the money out of that pocket than out the other pocket. You don't think about that when you see the fashion shows and you see all the white girls come out and then there's no black people. You don't say that when you have to kind of search through a channel to try to find a black person that's called a token. You don't say that then, but that's your show. So why say it now? Because you need to start there, but you didn't start then. I'm just saying. Anyway, it is what it is. You do you. You do you the best way you can. And if nobody don't like it, then fuck them. <laughs>